If I want to spend two days in Rasoheima, uh, what's the must-do list you want to recommend to me? So uh, definitely uh, a visit to Jebel Jais, uh, um, including a picnic uh, at the top. Uh, but before that, you certainly have to do the, the zip line, uh, the, the longest zip line in the world. The Jebel Jais flight is, is, is very unique and, and, and something that everyone must come here to do. Uh, the Via Ferrata, you know, hiking in the mountains. Uh, because until today, we have Bedouins who still live in the mountains in stone houses. And when people hike, they go through these villages and they meet these Bedouins who, you know, still live in the mountains, uh, which is, I think is very unique for, for this part of the world. Uh, but also, you know, biking uh, and really, really uh, serene and peaceful is just kayaking in the mangroves where you see beautiful marine life. Uh, and we're protecting this area because we don't allow any motorized sports into uh, that area. So we protect the marine life. So going kayaking through the mangroves is really peaceful and, and beautiful. Um, and, and of course, um, uh, you can't go without doing an evening uh, you know, in the Bedouin oasis where you can, you know, live the life of a Bedouin and, and, and see how they lived in tents and, and, and do an overnight uh, in camping in the desert. So there's a list, a list of things that you can do where you're in touch with nature and culture and, and heritage.